Hey Cancer, welcome to my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot. This is Chelsea in this reading. For those of you currently in separation, we're going to find out your person's feelings towards you right now. Today is the 6th of October 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 9.43 a.m. In Cancer, I'm giving away free personal reading for a lucky winner once a week. To enter, hit like, subscribe, and comment below. I love Cancer, or just give it a heart. It's free to subscribe. If you've commented before, uh, you can do it again. It will increase your chance of winning, and winners will be announced on the community page weekly. Are you ready, Cancer? Spirits and angels, please show me for Cancer. Currently in separation. How does the person feel about Cancer right now? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and your person. The Emperor at the bottom of the deck. So your person could be an Aries, could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Leo, Virgo, um, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio can be any sign. Okay, we all have multiple signs in that chart. I feel like with the Eight of Pentacles here, Cancer, your person has been focusing on something. Okay, I feel like this, they could be focusing on work. I feel like your person is very busy right now. During daytime, your person, you know, would be working and trying the best that they can to not think about you. But during nighttime, the hermit, because this is nighttime, okay? This is when they feel so lonely. And they wonder how you're doing, because this is you, doesn't matter. Uh, he or she is not gender specific. During nighttime, they could be thinking about you, feeling really lonely. wondering also if you still love them and then we've also got the star here judgment in reverse and the world they may feel like you have already closed this chapter i do sense i'm wondering if you still love them if you still have any feelings for them if there could even be any chance for both of you to reconcile Because the hermit essentially is kind of lost, again, in a dark, feeling really lonely, trying to find his or her way to their destination. I feel like Cancer, this is why it's like during the day, during the day, your person feels all right because they're distracted. They're working, right? They're trying to achieve something at work the sun they love the sun they love you know maybe the outdoors or during the day they are happy but at night this is when it hits them this is when it hits them that maybe this is over the world that a chapter has been closed the world also could mean the world wide web right they could be checking up on you online if you're active online looking at pictures as well because it does look like a frame doesn't it this uh, snake eating its own tail could be looking at your pictures seven of swords and my first and the king of swords and my first they feel like both of you are not communicating right now or wondering if it will be a good idea to communicate or communicate more then your person could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I'm going to clarify the Seven of Swords in love verse. I'll get to this last card later, okay? I'm going to clarify it. We're going to find out more. Um, but let's pull out more cards. The Emperor, Queen of Pentacles in love verse, Two of Cups in love verse, Three of Swords in love verse. Either they feel like you were responsible for the cause of the separation or that they were responsible for the cause of the separation. I do see them, again, cancer just working super, super hard. 
and they have something that they want to achieve, I guess this is something that helps them distract themselves from thinking too much about you or missing you. Queen of Pentacles, and one first. This could be you or this could be your person, Virgo, Capcom, Taurus. It's a masculine energy. This is the feminine energy, but we all have both, yeah? Masculine and feminine. It's just this energy of them wanting to do things right this time around. I feel like they are yearning for some sort of a respect at their workplace, make more money. They feel you're not invested anymore. Two cups of verse. It's very clear. Some of you, maybe you've made it clear that you're done or that they've made it clear to you that they are done. Again, it could go vice versa. But let's see a bit more through Swords of verse. Yeah, they're still going through healing and recovery. Four of Pentacles, Ten of Swords. They're keeping to themselves that they are in still a lot of pain, but you know, trying to move on, trying to heal. And Nine of Pentacles is here. Either they feel that Cancer, you are independent, you're doing your own thing now, and maybe you are happier, you've closed the chapter, but they often wonder if you still love them, if you still care about them. Some of you could be in a same gender relationship, not all of you. They still see a lot of qualities in you, now, I don't know why the Eight of Pentacles also could mean that. Um, I'm I'm also seeing like dating apps. They could be looking at all of the options on their dating app. Trying to maybe meet someone new. But I also see them comparing you to the other options. Because the star is... You know, somebody very unique. So this could be you. They could be feeling like you're somebody very unique. And they could be looking for something or someone like that. They're still holding on to you. But for some reason, they feel like you, you've you closed this chapter, like you're done. And they're looking for your replacement. Let's clarify these seven of swords in our verse. Spirits and angels, please clarify these seven of swords in our verse. An another judgment, look, two judgment uh, cards in our verse. So either they feel like they made the wrong judgment call, or right now maybe it's not the right judgment call for them to talk to you, reach out to you. These are the cards being clarified. Um, these are the cards clarifying the Seven of Swords. So Seven of Swords, Seven of Verse, they feel like maybe you've seen their true colors. There's somebody here, I feel like, because the Ten of Swords is going to get betrayal. For some of you, Cancer, if the cause has been because of a betrayal, an affair with the lovers here, then they may feel like this is like just... The way things ended was just so bad that they don't know if it's even a good judgment call to reconcile. I must say that they are, they are still attracted to you, okay, because of the lovers who does have feelings for you. They could be wishing that they made, you know, the, made a different choice, a different decision. The lover is going to get a choice, right? So they could be looking into if the damages, the damages that have been done to this connection, could it be undone? But for some reason, I feel like cancer. They feel like you've already moved on. I feel like you're independent. You're doing your own thing, and you've already moved on. And maybe there's no point of them in you know making that choice to reconcile some of you may have a child or children with this person not all of you it's just some of you 
they could also be thinking like the best for those of you cancer if you do have a child or children with your person they feel like as long as the children are okay they're fine hey cancer this is your reading i hope it serves you well don't forget to hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me all info is below make sure you subscribe it's free to subscribe and i'm very excited for the 15th of october you guys don't miss this live stream i'm going to be giving away free personal reading it's a once this is a one a month once a month affair <laughs> okay once a month uh, starting from this month so make sure you hit on the bell notification button and subscribe it's free to subscribe take care cancer i hope to see you back here again soon i love you bye